Hey everybody, this is Scott with Dr. Yates Hair Science Group here in Chicago. Um, standing here with our patient Kevin. Uh, Kevin had had a procedure, a hair restoration procedure, about a year ago. So he's coming back in to kind of see where he's at and, you know, us kind of evaluate where he was and where he's at at this point. So um, one of these things, I just wanted to make sure we always do this, is we want to make sure this is actually you, right Kevin? That is. That's, unfortunately yeah yes so about a year ago we did as you can see 1200 grafts to the front area um, Kevin is actually in the music industry so his appearance is very important so he's always got to try to do what he can to keep that you know top level top level top notch appearance going on um, he's also doing a lot of other stuff Rogaine and he's doing PRP which is platelet rich plasma to help hold on to the other hair um, Kevin, has anybody said anything to you about your hair since you've had the procedure done? Oh, definitely. Yeah. Um, I've told about three or four friends where I live, yeah. um, that I, before I had the procedure and right. you know, about three or four months in after the procedure happened, they started commenting, Oh my God, your hair looking great. Right. And then as time went on even more, it got even better. Uh, you yeah. know, more comments from them too, more compliments. Yeah makes you feel better, more confident. Absolutely. It kind of takes, because I know how I was when I was losing my hair, it was always something, it was always on your mind, you always constantly thought about it. Yep. Um, I know when I had my procedures and got to where I'm at, it's something I don't even think about anymore, and it becomes less of an, a, you know, uh, it kind of consumes you sometimes. It can, yeah. And so anyway, but yeah, that's what we kind of done. He's, he's very natural, and oh, here's Dr. Yates. Dr. Yates, hey. How are you doing? Hey, what's going on? Oh, hey, hey. Hey, it's good to see you. This, this can't be Kevin, can it? <laughs> it is. It oh is. my God. No improved. Let's see, let's see. Yes. So how, how long ago was this, guys? This is a year ago. Wow, a year ago. ago. Look at that. Is, mm. How does that make you feel? That makes me feel really uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> what it's kind of like is, if, has anyone ever been on a diet when you were like 500 pounds, or not 500, or maybe like 50 pounds overweight? And then you see a picture of you when you were 50 pounds overweight, and you see a picture of you now, and you're like, how did I let myself go? You know? <laughs> and in your case, you didn't let yourself go, just nature did just what nature. it had to do. Yeah. You know? And I know you're in the music business, so appearance is a big deal. Is. And your hair looks good. Let's see, turn this way. Nice, nice, you got it. Oh, calm, nice there, turn this way. Wow, that's awesome. And before, you can see his styles were pretty limited, yeah. especially, let's see, that's your that's right side good. there. That's yeah. the part side. Yeah. The part side was really taking a beating over there. Yeah. So it looks a lot better. Yeah. So I know Scott probably asked you this, but did anybody say anything about your hair and your colleagues? Um, colleagues, yeah. I mean, they, they've noticed that it's, it's nice. I haven't told a lot of them, um, most okay. of just close friends. Um, okay. But, you know, I, I do just feel more confident, uh, you know, in my business and um, walking around and stuff like that. So. It, I mean, it looks amazing. So how many did we do? Let me see the back. Let's turn around here. We did how many, Scott? 1,200 uh, 12 grams. 1,200. So the key is that it's no way to tell that you had anything done. This back looks right. great. Yeah. Like, say, if you had a scar, you know, like an FUT scar, People would always hold the hair up and say you can't even see the scar. Right. But why get a wait, why get a scar if you don't have to get one? Why talk about something that you really don't need to even talk about? The other thing we always say with pictures, you want to go like to like. Like, see how the length of his hair is here. The length of his hair is about the same now because if you don't go like to like, say, suppose he had come in here with his hair completely shaved down like Vin Diesel we couldn't appreciate the difference because you can't tell. And that's where, you know, we get a lot of comments about people that, you know, have shaved heads and then their hair grows out miraculously and, you know, how is that possible? And, you know, we want people to just, you know, think beyond that. You have to compare like to like. So I know you're in the music business, but, you know, how is it working with two chains? You work with two chains? <laughs> Not yet. Not yet. Not well, yet. He hasn't worked with two chains. <laughs> I, I've never worked with two chains either. What about Drake? You, you Drake? Oh, Drake and I are good friends. Drake, well, yeah. Drake, yeah. Clearly, yeah. Drake and I, we have a session. You know, I'm on the bongo like Randy Jackson with Drake all the time. And Drake's hair looks good, I might add. But, you know, so I guess you're glad you came here, right? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, okay. it's a life changer for sure. Okay. Yeah. So we're in Chicago. So all you fancy musicians and actors and whoever from the East Coast and the West, we're right here to help you. Dr. Yates, this is Scotty, of course, our educator, and Kevin, our, of course, our musician that has done it all. So come see us soon. Thank you.